I come from classical acting and I'm trying improv for a while. Uh, I still haven't decided what I prefer. So I think in normal classical theater, um, you have a lot of time to perfect something, okay? To, to, to if you practice this, this specific scene for, for a long time, then you get a real, real high level of performance. So, so that your voice and your, your the tones you use and the body language and, and the setting and, and everything is is precise. It's like it's like a painting. It's like something that's that's perfect. In improv many times you, you say something that could have been better and could have been, you know, perfected if you had the chance, but you can't because it's because it's on the fly. So that's that's a pro for classical theater. But of course Improv. First of all, it's, it's more convenient. It's more comfortable. You can you can have it anywhere, all the time. I think it's it's a totally different skill set, and um, I find it very challenging. And I like the challenge. Um, it's amazing to me when, especially when I see other improv shows, to see how how crazy and, and illogical things can happen. So so beautiful and so beautifully connect to each other, and and. Just this idea that you can really abandon all, you know, orderly trains of thought and just just flow with with intuitive ideas that just come up, and of course communication. Improv has so so much communication between the, the players on stage, and and that's beautiful.